YouTube channel. Today I'm going to review three pairs of bicycling sunglasses I found on Amazon. I believe these are all manufactured in China. We have first the Rock Bros polarized sports sunglasses, which were $17.99. We have the Capvo cycling glasses, which were $27.99, the most expensive of the group. And then finally we have the Ukoli polarized sports sunglasses. All three are still in the original packaging. I've not opened them yet. So let's take a look and see what they look like. So first, we're going to zoom in a little bit. Start with the Rock Brothers. Very nice hard case. Note this label's pulling off a little bit. Not a big deal, but interesting for quality control. But this is a pretty, very, very thick case here. Very nice. So, what do we got here? We have a nice little cleaning cloth. Very nice. We have a nice silk, silky feeling sunglass case. Put the sunglasses in. We have looks like a strap for the sunglass hard case, which I guess it connects there. We have a little cord to connect to the glasses. Very nice. The little test paper to test your polarized lenses, a pair of prescription frames, you can put in your own custom prescription frames I guess, and finally of course we have the sunglasses, and then we have one, two, three, four different sunglass shade colors. So that is the Rock Brothers sunglasses. Got the Rock Brothers glasses here. First thing I noticed, they feel very lightweight, which is great, but they feel very thin. What I mean thin, the, the lenses look thin, which is fine. Um, my initial impression is they feel cheap. Now, I don't know how these look um, once outside with the, them on my face, but that's my initial impression. They just feel a little kind of chintzy. Um, these open up pretty well, so these do have come with a protective layer film. I guess I'll pull off. It does say polar eyes lens. Very nice. On the inside, we have a pretty nice nose grip here. I don't know if this may be bend flexible here, but this is um, rubber. There's a nice little rubber pad along the forehead, I imagine, to absorb sweat. Um, and there are some other nice features, though. I do see that the temples have a nice little rubber grip here. You can tell with um, some little dots, little holes, not only on the outside, but also on the inside as well. These nice little rubber grips. I imagine these would grip to your face pretty nicely. So this is the Rock Bros. Again, these were $17.99. Um, they did come with... A variety of lenses. We have a clear lens, a yellow lens, which I believe is for night night riding. We have a blue tinted lens, maybe for overcast days. And finally, we have a looks like a brownish colored lens here. So that is again the Rock Bros sunglasses. Next on the list here, we have are the Capvo. Cycling glasses. This is the most expensive set on my list from Amazon. It's twenty-seven dollars and ninety-nine cents. It did come in this nice box with some cool graphics. See, it says Cap Bow. Let's take a look at it. See what it looks like. So we have a nice hard case. The logo, of course, the inside. This is really quite nice. It's nylon. It's hard plastic. So great, uh, great to protect the contents of it. Let's take a look see what we got inside. So we have 
a nice silk-like uh, protective case for the glasses, soft case. We have a test card to test your polarized lenses. Very nice. We have some kind of instructions. Protect how to protect your glasses. Um, very nice. I guess details on the different kind of lenses and what kind of lights they flip through. It's actually very very useful. We have the sunglasses themselves with the blue lens. We have a prescription ready frame. You can put your own prescriptions and these clip inside the glasses. And then we have one yellow lens, looks like a clear lens, a dark polarized lens, and then finally we have a oh, nice little mirrored lens. And then there's some straps inside you can connect the glasses to. So here we have the cap bow frames out. Let's see what looks like. Comes in a protective case. These are look quite nice. Um, definitely heavier than the Rock Bros. The quality seems a little bit better. They are almost twice the price. They still feel a little cheap when you open the frame. There's some flexing here. Um, I do like that bluish purple tint. Looks very nice. On the inside we have a very nice nose guard. It doesn't look like it's adjustable, but pretty thick. On the temples, there is, though it's hard to see, there's a rubber coated uh, end right here. So that is rubber coated there. And this tip here is also rubber coated. The rubber is on the outside and the inside. They do look bigger than the other ones, which is okay. But this is the Capfo sunglasses from Amazon. Let's look at some of the accessories they gave us a little bit more detail. So we have a, a nice mirrored lens. Comes with a darker, look like this is the polarized lens. These lenses feel a little bit thicker than the Rock Bros, so I, I feel a little bit more comfortable with the comfortable with the quality of this glass. Here we have a, just a clear lens. And finally we have a yellow, yellow lens for you know, night or evening writing. And here's the the manual again, which is again of all the glasses, I haven't seen anything this detailed where it does break down the different lenses and what kind of colors they filter. Again, this is the prescription frame. Now I do wear glasses and I was interested in wearing these sunglasses. I'm right now I'm gonna see if they just fit over my regular glasses. I'm gonna try that. This could be an option. This feels Kind of cheap, but I guess it is lightweight. Of course, we have the case and the test card and then the strap. So, cap flows are my favorite so far. Let's move on to the last set of glasses. Last on the list, we have the Ukoli Polarized Sports Sunglasses. This is also found on Amazon. It was priced at $20.98. Again, it comes in a nice hard case nylon coated. This has almost a reflective weave on it. Very nice. We have instruction manual. Shows you how to replace the lenses. It looks like it gives you some details on the different colored lenses. We have the prescription frames, which we'll clip in. We have the sunglasses themselves. Comes with this nice blue colored uh, reflective frame installed. 
we have our test card, a little bit different than the other one, it says test the polarized lenses. We have a little connecting cord, you can put them on the sunglasses and keep them around your face. Um, like the others, cleaning cloth, and a nice little silk case. I get the feeling a lot of these sunglasses are manufactured the same facility. They all come with similar card here. Some of these products are all a little bit similar. But anyway, so then this is a little bit different. The lenses themselves, it looks like they come in this nice little protective Allen case. So that is the Ucoli sunglasses. So let's look at the Ucoli sunglasses a little, a little more depth on the plastic case. These have a, a frame very similar to the, or the lens very similar to the, the cap foes. Uh, I'm not a real big fan of this pattern on here. I actually ordered a black frame, solid black. And this one is, looks like it's has some paint speckles, some turquoise and maybe purple speckles. Not sure if I like that. It looks like they're actually speckled. I can feel them being braised, but um, you know, I ordered the black. I'm not sure why I got these. Looks like they have some little vents in here to let air flow through. Supposedly, it'll help keep the sunglasses from fogging up. They feel pretty good weight. They're not not real light. They definitely feel quality plastic. Definitely higher quality than the Rock Bros. Now, it's interesting when you open them up. There's a lot of tension here. It looks like they really got to pull it. I don't want to. Feels like I'm going to break it, but they kind of like snap in place. I'm not sure if that's a feature or not. That is not not something I'm a fan of. I'm worried that that would break. But to open them up, you really got to kind of put some pressure. They do snap into place. It looks like once they're open, um, they look look okay. On the inside, you have a nice nose guard. Looks like it's very flexible, not really adjustable. The temples have rubber tips that go all the way around. It seems like that'd be pretty comfortable. The frames are fairly thick, almost thick, kind of like the cap foes, and definitely thick, thicker than the Brock Bros. So these would be my be my second preference, although I am worried about the, the tightness of these temples. I wonder if that can be loosened with a screwdriver. But let's take a look at some of the other items that came with it. So we have cleaning cloth, again the case, soft case, glasses, Cord. You can attach the glasses, the sunglasses too. Directions, and let's take a look at the, the lenses. They come in this nice little pouch. So we have a. I can't tell what kind of lens this is. Maybe a clear lens, lightly smoked. Uh, it's hard to say. Maybe it looks like it's a clear lens with a slight tint. There is a yellow lens. We have a lightly blue tinted lens. And then we have, looks like the polarized lens here. Could test out the polarized lens. This is always kind of fun. So they gave you this little card here with an image. It looks like of a road. So what I'm going to do is hold. Well, first of all, let's hold this up here so you can kind of see. There we go. This is kind of hard. There we go. So there you go. See a little bit of the image there. So non-polarized, polarized. Anyway. So that is the Ucoli. So just to take a 
final look at all three pair now kind of lined up. We have the Rock Brothers for $17.99. Um, definitely lightweight. They feel, like I said, a little chintzy. Um, frames feel a little thin. It seems like the quality of the lenses is not as nice as the Cap Faux or the, the Rock Brothers. We have the Cap Faux, which I think is maybe the nicest of the three in terms of the lens quality. Uh, definitely is a bigger framed set, so it'll probably give you some more protection while you're riding. And finally, we have the, the Ukulis, which I think are almost good. However, I'm a little concerned about the, the tightness in the, the hinges here. Again, I understand. I think they're trying to make it feel like a snaps into place, but it's, it's it's has me worried that they'll break out. Again, all three are available on Amazon. Rock Bros was $17.99. The Cat Foes were $27.99. And then finally, the Ukulis were $20.98. So I'll provide links below. Thank you for viewing.